The two-minute message preview at the non-denominational New Hope Olympia is entitled, How to Handle the Bump in the Road. In his weekend message, Pastor Dell will talk about the thorn in Paul's life. Paul shares his story in 2 Corinthians chapter 12, verses 1 through 10. The Apostle Paul says, I was caught up to the third heaven fourteen years ago. Whether I was in my body or out of my body, I don't know, only God knows. Yes, only God knows whether I was in my body or outside my body. But I do know that I was caught up to paradise and heard things so astounding that they cannot be expressed in words, things no human is allowed to tell. Has this ever happened to you? The phone rings, and on the other end, there's bad news. You go to the mailbox, and there's a letter from the IRS, a past due notice, and more bad news. You go to the doctor, and he gives you bad news. There's a knock on your door, bad news. Sure, we have all had these times. However, few things will draw the Christian toward God and His Word, like pain and suffering. Suffering. No one wants it, and no one enjoys it. The Apostle Paul had had one of the most remarkable experiences anyone could have. He had been permitted to see things no one else had ever seen. Paul could have very easily been filled with pride. To be caught up in the very heavens with God. But then there's a bump in his road. He gets a thorn in his flesh. He, one of the godliest people of the Bible, prays and asks God to remove the thorn, but God says, No, but my grace will be sufficient. Paul tells us his vision, the vexation of the thorn in the flesh he experienced, and the victory he gained over it. When the Apostle Paul experienced this bump in the road, he learned seven valuable lessons from it. Just as the Apostle Paul had this thorn in the flesh, we, too, have our thorns that we have to deal with. The lessons that Paul learned from his thorn in the flesh we too can also learn and apply to our lives.